Hi, this is JP from Now the Lights Over Arkham. Welcome to Heroic Mode Challenges. This time we will be playing Captain Marvel Protection against Crossbones on Heroic 1 difficulty. Uh, I decided to start a new series where I play uh, the villains on Heroic 1 difficulty and trying out different heroes to beat them. So I decided to start with Captain Marvel and let's look at uh, Captain Marvel's deck first. We have the usual protection allies. We have Clea, uh, Iron Fist, Luke Cage is in the deck because Luke Cage has an energy symbol for resources. Then there's Nova and of course Mockingbird and Nick Fury are usually pretty useful. I chose these allies because Iron Fist is really good to slow down the villain. So we can keep the villain stunned for a couple of turns while we keep pounding on him or, uh, with uh, Captain Marvel. Uh, then there are a lot of energy symbols in the deck to power up the energy channels. I also added resource balls because they can act as any resource type and I just wanted to have something to either thin down the deck if I don't have anything to play or just spend as uh, energy resources for anything. Then uh, I am trying out the new Master Courage card that is uh, from the Ant-Man hero pack that can really slow down the enemy as you can make your allies uh, tough so you can jump block more often with them and that helps you to stay in hero mode longer. The deck's main focus is to stay in hero mode as much as possible and keep on dealing damage to the villain. So let's see how the plan works. We have the usual modular sets in the encounter deck, nothing out of the pre-suggested modular sets. As we start from the phase 2 we have a crossbones machine gun in play and we still need to figure out which uh, experimental weapon Crossbone has, but for that I think that is enough of the Deccan scenario, so let's get started. So we need to shuffle the experimental cards, let's see what uh, experimental weapon Crossbone gets. So we get the power gauntlets. Just place the rest here. So, uh, power gauntlets is a force response after the attacks villain attacks and damages you discard one card from your hand. And hero action spend a mental and a physical resource, discard this card. I'll just place it over here. We will draw our opening hand. We get uh, Night's Nurse, Nick Fury, Mockingbird, Energy Barrier, Strength, and Nova. Mm, I think I will. I think I will uh, pay Nick Fury and Mulligan the rest. So we get Med Team, Photonic Blast, Energy Channel and Resourceful. We start our turn by using the Commander uh, ability. So we draw one more card. Let's play Nick Fury. I think we don't need Resourceful. Oh, actually, let's keep Resourceful. We'll use Strength 
resourceful and uh, yeah let's play cosmic flight then we use uh, the Fury's ability to draw three cards we get power of protection master of courage and Bee Harrier. I think we'll play energy resource. Actually put it over here. Then uh, we still have these cards to play with. Uh, I think we'll flip to Captain Marvel. Uh, I'll use the power of protection, Queen Carry and Master Courage to play Protonic Blast. We deal 5 damage. And because we spent one energy resource, we draw a card. We get the momentum shift. Not very useful. I think I'm uh, ditching the med team to place one counter on the energy channel. And I think I will. I think I'll uh, cycle the momentum shift. Then Nick Fury will attack for 2 damage. And Captain Marvel will attack for 2 damage. Uh, let's draw our replacement hand. So we ready up and get Med Steam, Energy Absorption. Resourceful, Crisis Interdiction, and Photonic Blast. Okay, let's go to the villain phase. Uh, we add a threat to the main scheme. And Crossbone attacks, Nick Fury will defend. Crossbone hits for uh, 4 damage, so Fury will be defeated. And we also activate the Crossbone's machine gun. And we take one damage, and that is that. Then we get encounter cards, and reminder, we are playing non-heroic, so we draw one extra encounter card each round. So the first encounter card is Hydra Soldier, and the second one is another Hydra Soldier. Okay, well, that is quite unlucky, but I think we have some ways to deal damage, so that is that turn. Let's go to the next turn. I think we need to Photonic Blast the uh, first Hydra Soldier. So this gets defeated and we draw an encounter card. So we will be getting four encounter cards this round. So that will hurt quite a lot. Then we draw a card with the Photonic Blast. We get the energy channel. Uh, I think we'll spend the med team. And boost energy channel up by one. I'll use the energy channel to get uh, defeat the other Hydra soldier. We get another encounter card. We'll play the other energy channel and fire it up. And we'll attack for two damage. So, uh, we ready up, we throw back up to 5, uh, we get Master Courage, Energy Barrier, Crisis Interdiction, Spider-Woman and Energy Barrier. Uh, Crossbone attacks, actually let's, yeah, well it's too late. We add a threat to the main scheme, crossbone attacks. I won't defend, so we'll take uh, 2 plus 2, so 4 damage. Then we discard one card from our hand. I'll discard the energy barrier. Actually, I'll discard the uh, Master Courage. Then uh, we 
use the last charge from the machine gun and we take no damage because there are no boosts in pulse so we got lucky there then we get the encounter card so we have four encounter cards to resolve first one is another hydra soldier under fire uh, search reveal the top card of the encounter deck so we get Hydra Bomber and the Search Guard is uh, Weapon Master. The villain attacks you if they have a weapon attachment. This card can search and crossbone attacks for uh, 2 damage plus 2, so 4 damage. And we have to discard a card from our hand. Let's discard the Crisis Interdiction. And uh, that card can search, assault, <laughs> we'll defend, and we're dead. So we still need to figure out which experimental weapon Crossbone gets. So he has the laser rifle. So, force interrupt when attacks, villain attacks, the attack gains ranged, so retaliate doesn't work. And hero action spend a lightning bolt and a, so a energy and a physical resource. Discard this card and plus one damage. We draw our opening hand. Uh, we get uh, momentum shift, alpha point station, iron fist, energy absorption, energy, cosmic flight. I think we are getting rid of cosmic flight and momentum shift. Actually, we can just uh, play the alpha flight with that. So let's see. Let's just keep everything. Uh, I'll play the alpha. Uh, no, I'll use uh, Carol Danvers' commander ability to draw a card. Well, that's not really helpful. Well, it is. Uh, we'll play Iron, Iron Fist with these cards. So let's put them aside. We are not getting rid of those. I'll Use the momentum shift to play Alpha Flight Station. I'll exhaust Alpha Flight Station and discard Cosmic Flight to draw two cards. I get the Avengers Mansion and Master Courage. I'll use Energy Absorption and Master Courage to play Avengers Mansion. I'll draw a card. We get the uh, Photonic Blast. I'll keep that for next turn. We'll flip to Captain Marvel and let's play Iron Fist. We get two Mystic Counters on Iron Fist. Then uh, we'll keep this in hand and use one Mystic Counter from Iron Fist. I'll do three damage on Crossbones and stun Crossbones. Then I will just hit for two damage. And that is my turn. I'll keep the Phantotonic Blast in hand. Draw back up to 5. We get Resourceful, Crisis Interdiction, Med Team, Energy Absorption and Photonic Blast. Okay. Uh, we go to the Villain Phase. We add a threat to the main scheme. I will draw a card. Uh, we first remove the stun, crossbone doesn't attack and actually we forgot to put one damage on iron fist so we get two uh, encounter cards because we are playing on heroic first one is crossbones assault uh, when defeated crossbones attack activates against the player who defeated this scheme so we get an acceleration token 
then uh, there is two threats on this scheme. Then the other one is Legions of Hydra. When revealed, if Madame Hydra is not in play, search the counter deck and discard pile for Madame Hydra and put her in play, engage with you. Then shuffle the encounter deck, place two additional threats here for each Hydra enemy in play. And as a reminder, Crossbone is Hydra enemy, so that is quite annoying. So let's see where Madame Hydra is hiding near the top of the deck. And I'll just place this here. So we get uh, four seven red on this scheme, and I think we are just trying to burn down crossbones as fast as possible. There is no way to deal with all of these uh, side schemes with this deck. We just have to try and uh, win before those become too big of a problem but uh, and we can't hurt Madame Hydra while the legends of Hydra is in play so that is that turn let's go to the next turn we start by drawing car with the mansion we get energy channel okay mm. I think I'm just hitting with the uh, iron actually uh, I will Photonic Blast first. Uh, we'll remove 5 damage from here. We draw a card. Get Luke Cage. Okay. Okay, this is a bit silly, but uh, we really need to keep. Well, okay. I, I think. Uh, we can't keep. Well, uh, there is no way to keep the uh, crossbone stunned, so... Okay, I think I, I just have to face it. I can't stun crossbones, so I just hit it for 2 damage and uh, hit for 2 damage. I won't spend the uh, mystic counter this turn, so we advance to phase 3 and the second experimental weapon is uh, the exosuit actually I think we will play the energy channel I will spend all of these and place 4 counters on this then uh, Let's put the health on crossbones. So crossbones has 16 health. And I will use the energy channel. So we deal 8 damage. Let's put it like so. Then I will flip to Outer Ego, I'll draw a card, I'll use the Alpha Flight Station to discard and draw two, and I'll play the Energy Barrier. Okay, we ready up, we draw back up to six, then we get Mockingbird, Energy Barrier, Momentum Shift, Clea, Photonic Blast and Mets Team, so Let's count quickly. If we don't thread out and get like a bunch of guard minions, which now that I said it will, uh, we have 5, 8, 10 damage. Plus 2 here if we get enough resources. So, but we, we can't play it because we haven't taken any damage. Okay, well, we have the damage for next turn, but let's see how the encounter decks work out, uh, encounter cards work out. 
So we add two threat to the main scheme, it advances. And we get an third experimental weapon and it is the retaliate one. I'll just just put it here. Then Madame Hydra schemes for two and well no first. Uh, crossbone schemes for two plus three, so five, and we go to the next. Okay. And uh, we get the last experimental. Then we get two encounter cards plus one from the Legion Hydra. Uh, first one is it's a Hydra soldier, so we are not winning on next turn. Then we get combat knife and coat of guard. We discard an upgrade or support. Uh, I think I'll discard. Should I discard the Alpha Flight? Uh, both. Uh, we have one energy channel in the deck, so we could try to fetch that. Then we have both of the energy absorptions here. That's a tough call. I think we'll just no. Uh, let's discard the energy barrier. Okay, and that is the villain phase. Let's go to the next hero phase. Uh, we'll draw a card with the Avengers Mansion. We get Spider Woman. I'll uh, let's see. I think I'll discard Spider Woman or uh, I'll discard. Yeah, I, I can't play Momentum Shift, so I discard that. Actually, I can play it uh, if I attack twice. Oh well, I'll uh, discard that and draw two cards. I'll get uh, Genius and Crisis Interdiction. Then I'll use the commander ability to draw one card. Okay, so we have a big, big hand. Uh, now let's think about how we're doing this turn. So I think I am a photonic. No, I could uh, play Claire. And use Iron Fist to defeat Hydra Soldier. Then I'll hit, I'll take one damage. Then I will Photonic Blast and draw a card. And I have enough to play Spider Woman and defeat. Bones. Okay, I think that that works. So I'll uh, hit Hydra Soldier with Iron Fist and spend the uh, Mystical Counter. So we stun and deal one damage extra. I'll play Clea. Uh, Clea hits for one damage here, defeating Hydra Soldier. He gets an encounter card. Then I will flip to Captain Marvel. I'll hit for two damage. I'll play Photonic Blast and I spend one energy resource, so I deal five damage. I draw one card, I get Nick Fury, and I think I will. So, yeah, Nick Fury will come in and uh, hmm. yeah, I'll just draw three cards. Okay, <laughs> I will 
USA Energy Channel. I will uh, load it up by one and I just hit with Fury. Yeah, that is it. So Nick Fury takes two damage. Okay, well, um, that was crossbones on heroic difficulty uh, with Captain Marvel protection. Uh, I had to play this scenario a couple of times to get off the win. First time uh, I lost in two turns because uh, I just got a bunch of Hydra soldiers and I got like a ton of uh, encounter cards and uh, those wrecked me completely and I got three attacks from crossbones in one turn and died but this time I was able to finish off crossbones before he got to attack even once and uh, even Madame Hydra couldn't help crossbones this time but yeah that is the first of my hero mode challenges done thanks for watching hope you like this uh, format uh, give me suggestions which uh, villains you want to see on hero mode and maybe i'll play them soon enough and as usual thanks for watching until next time